Detectives investigating the attempted bomb attacks on the Antrim Road in Belfast last month say a child's bicycle was used to hide a booby trap device. They've arrested three suspects. Julie McCulloch has more. This was the child's bicycle left by the would-be bombers. If you look closely at the back wheel, you can see a black wire at the left-hand side. Police say this was attached to a booby trap device. They actually deploy a secondary device and use a push bike, a children's bike, where a young child would come across it and be uh, tempted to move it or to lift it. It is, uh, it is reckless to the extreme. The police want to find out more about where this bicycle came from. They also want to speak to this man. The CCTV pictures show him throwing a brick at the window of the extra vision on the Antrim Road, the site of the first bomb. It is my assessment that it is possible this was an attempt to uh, lure police to the area. This, this is a major line of inquiry and the identification of this person is vital. What police didn't know when they went to Extra Vision that night to investigate what had happened was that a device had been planted in the fence ready to be fired at them as they arrived. For reasons unknown to them, the device wasn't triggered and remained in place for a number of days. The booby trap bomb attached to the bicycle was only found after army technical officers went looking for a secondary device. Three men are currently being questioned about the incident. Julie McCulloch, BBC Newsline, North Belfast.